Greetings! Welcome back to the Sinking City. Let's go to the to Joseph's place, and we'll deliver him one bullet straight to the head. But first of all, I have to create one. So give me a second. Do we have? We have another skill point. That's nice. Give me that. And we are close. Getting another one. I might go for that one. Okay. First of all, hmm. yes, I'm pretty confident in my shooting skills. I shouldn't be, but I am. <laughs> this is somewhere around here. No, on the block. Okay. I'm the fancy guy. There's some of them around here. Whoa. Sorry. Your vote is your choice. Choose wisely. Oh, Joseph. Oh, can I loot some of your place? No. Hello. Can we talk? I need an explanation, Joseph. Exactly. What did you want to know? I found the lab. Found the laboratory, Joseph. The one used to raise dead from the ashes and salt. So then you understand why I need Usha's body. She knows what we both need. The way inside Kotigan are. You revived the dead, then tortured them. That's an abomination. Do not rust to judgment, Reed. They had their time. Would you truly value one old life over the suffering of millions? They're not even human. Those specters, monstrosities, they are just the vessels of their former knowledge. You can't compare them to the living. Yeah, but you still tortured them. You tormented Usha to get the knowledge you were after. Why? She refused to tell me what I needed. I was trying to find another way, but until the spell was found, I used more mundane methods. Like pouring acid on her? It was stubborn. No longer human. I was forced to try everything. Every time I recreated her, she told me I didn't deserve the knowledge. I know you had a deal with Raymond, the man who brought you the mummy. What happened to him? Nothing he didn't deserve. Hey. This newcomer, he was only interested in treasure. It's his fault Ucha is after us now. He's her toy now, possessed and tormented. But it was you who let this happen. Me? I did not free her. And for Kay's sake, why should I risk everything to save an imbecile? My mission is of far greater importance. Yeah, I'm definitely gonna kill you. She is willing to help me get inside Katiganor. What? Surely not. It must be a trap. You didn't even ask me what she wanted in return. I fear I know already. She wants me dead. Dane, she's using you, Reed. She knows I'm the only one who can stop her. I have already prepared the Ungwent to prevent her resurrection. Please, can't we just finish this as planned? Hmm. I don't know whether she's trying to trick me. God damn it. Hmm. Okay, let's go with her Sorry, still. Joseph. I don't want to deal with either of you. But Usha is the one who knows what I need, not you. Nothing personal. You're doing us all. I won't let you do this. Whoa. Okay, I killed Joseph and Mr. Oyman. Let's heal up and let's fight into Usha. No, there are only springs inside here. You did Hello. She is pleased. Thank you. Enter her home, and she will tell you the secret of the depths. Seems like a lot of running around when we're already talking. The vessel through which she talks would hear what he does not deserve. She would prefer 
not to kill him. Okay. Where will I find you? Didn't she tell you about the stone fingers in the garden where the dead men live on? She thought you'd understand. I know from the cemetery. Can't you be more specific? A garden for the dead. It, is that a cemetery or crypt? See? You did have it. Okay then. I'm on my way. No, oh, he seems pretty out of it. Okay, so where's it? Where's the cemetery? I know about one cemetery. Mm, to oh, does that give me nothing? I think in somewhere. I think the. I'm sorry. I remember cemetery being somewhere around here. I'm gonna put the marker around here because I don't know. I have to find something. I don't think so. The entrance in the cemetery might be five fingers. Okay. Pretty sure this is where this this is the cemetery we're looking for. I don't remember any other one. Yeah, because you know we've read about the in about the cemetery being infested, so to speak. Uh, here, I'm going here. So hopefully that is not the case anymore. We'll be able to get through without any trouble. Maybe. Okay. Let's get over here. No, sorry, game. La the uh, Joseph doesn't live on Lambert Street anymore. I made sure of that. I wonder who's gonna pick up his corpse. Well, maybe Raymond. Raymond? Raymond? The guy will do that. Hello, how are you? Good day to you, kind sir. I hope that angels will be more merciful to you than they were with me. Oh, poor me. Did something happen? Some Danes robbed the graves in the cemetery. If I don't find the body soon, city council will find out. But, but I have no idea where to start. I'll be fired, I know it. And it's the only job I'm fit for. That's what my mama said. I can help you. I'm quite experienced at finding people alive, usually. Oh, thank the angels, kind sir. I'll, I'll repay you, I will. You'll find the three robbed graves in the cemetery. I marked them. And you don't need to muck up your suit lug and bodies round, sir. I can do that. Just find all three and tell me where they are. No, okay. please. Rest in peace. Oh. Oh, and I can find evidence around. God damn it. Can you show me that. Oh, and they are marked Grace. For Grace. What the hell? What is the Grace? Uh, marked Graves. How he marked the. Mar how he marked them. What? It's cozy. How can I get to the cemetery though? I have to get. Oh. Oh, okay. That explains a lot. Okay, I think this is one of the marked graves. Sure weren't ordinary grave robbers. During the exhumation of a mage, you need to protect yourselves. Uh, use the following signs and inc incantations to submerge the magician's mind into a deep astral dream. There's a library stamp at the bottom of the page. Unknown. Lift unto 1812. Sure weren't ordinary grave robbers. Okay, so they are marked by red... Uh, Cloth with with a red cloth, I, I should say. 
Okay, so first of all, let's continue going the other way. Make uh, this is what I wanted to not to do. Okay, here's another one. My beloved Virginia, I'm fulfilling your final wish. You will rest in your own house forever. Forgive me, for I was not brave enough to declare my love to you while you were among the living. I will atone for my mistake. Very neat. Someone spent a lot of time opening it. Virginia Cooper, 1887 to... Hmm. Another victim of the flood. An honorable citizen. Okay. This is the second grave. Ivan Kupienko, janitor. Jason Allen Brooks, respiring in 3, 2, 1, connection lost. <laughs> I love those graves. It reminds me of Fable. A man. Irina Bellows, brutally murdered by a passerby. Oh, there's someone brutally murder murdered. <laughs> For fuck's sake, I hate you. I'm sorry about destroying the graveyard, but I hate you. Showing me the way, which I'm not gonna go just yet. Come on, you can open. Can't carry anymore. If you say so. Okay. Now oh, I'm pretty sure I can carry some more. Okay. Mm Again, come on, come on. I'm not gonna listen to you just yet, because I'm pretty sure there's another dog upgrade inside. No, it's a crib. It's a diving suit. Hell no. 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 No, not yet. <laughs> this one looks peculiar. Murdered by her addition in chef in chief. Okay, I still need to find another grave. Oh, we've been here. Oakmoon crematorium. This is where I, where I this is where I, where I learned that the cemetery is infested. Well, that's pretty. Can I go inside? Yeah. Oh, here's the other grave. No, we've got to be kidding. The coffin was barely covered with dirt. A grave digger could do a better job. Edgar Taylor, victim of the flood. Okay, what other evidence can I find? The other had. All the ones had a note of some kind, but this one does not. 
pretty sure I'm lacking one piece of evidence. I found all three graves. But okay, can we talk? Oh, there's an cemetery is almost sunken and half of its graves are ruined. Why do you care about these three in particular? They were dug up by some people. That's bad. Others are sunken, taken by the mayor. That's not bad. You must not touch what was taken by the mayor, or the waters will curse you. That's what my mama said. Bye. Okay, the, and that wasn't the last piece we were looking for. Are those? No, it was about the side case. Or are those two mixed up? This one was about the mage. Come on, I know I can get up there. Mm, wait, here's the... Oh, I'm gonna mark them because otherwise I'm gonna run like a headless chicken. Let's say it's a mystery. This is where I found some evidence. Lacey of Palumbo, fire and blood. Sounds like a title of a book. Here's another one. There was a note a note that we took with us. So here's another one. I'm gonna mark no gonna mark that a we wish it could be oh oh I cannot place marker so close to the other one can I yeah it has to be no no I don't trust that you're gonna only say something about that but let's look at our let's look at our casebook hmm only to find the location of all three bodies as the guard will be... Okay, so we found two. There's, that's for the library. There's for the, that's for the city hall. And the third grave had no information on it. But where was it? Here. No, that's the coffin. Or casket, depends how you want to call it. Hmm. Oh, there's some more stuff. Well, there's lots of stuff. Is that? Ah, there's nothing interesting, apparently. Okay, need to find the other one again. I think it was somewhere around this place. Sure, it was somewhere here near the bridge. Yeah, it's here. They check this victim. Okay, victim of the flood. Coffin was barely covered with dirt. A grave digger could do a better job. Hmm. Scratches are fresh. It looks broken from the inside out. And this. You don't get to you don't get anything else from that you didn't see anything did you hmm interesting because I found the third wave but can tell whether to look for for a walking corpse or what? Beacon out? Hell, like I know. Okay, I was supposed. <gasps> oh, I found something. Blood is almost soaked into the soil. 
Oh, that's the evidence I needed. And do you guys want me to go somewhere? Apparently don't want me to go anywhere. Anymore. Oh, those are the fingers! Yay! I knew not to touch the thing. Okay. Alright, I'm ready. I'm not. I'm not. No, I don't want to go there. Please, just let me go straight to the objective without any anything happening. Please. I beg you. Please. Wait. Take out harpoon. Don't breathe, read. You bubbles are scaring me. And what the hell is scaring you? And it's pretty effective if you ask. Okay, I see now. What? Okay. What the hell? Nope. I'm glad that he's only scared by visuals, not and not sounds. Otherwise, he would go. Crazy pretty quickly. God damn, I see nothing. Nothing at all. Well, it might be partially because it's very bright outside. Okay. I know that it works only for a time that I get to reload it. Okay. Oh my god. I like that those sequences are very short and very straightforward. Otherwise, I would stop playing the game right away once I've gotten myself the first of those sections. I fulfilled my part of the deal. Now it's your turn. What's marked, man? Ask and she will answer. Stop the cycle like the cab before you. Like the ancestors. What lies beneath this city? Tell me about the ruins. A temple. A prison. A cradle of old Kay. A dark pit speaking with many voices. She never knew. Only a name. Ktikonar. How do you know this? She asked the dead. The dead who came before. And they asked their dead like you ask her now. This is the cycle. Tell me how I can enter the temple. You must find a sacred seal. The key to the monoliths. You and it know each other. It will obey. You mean this one? Yes, yes, fate is kind. Now listen well. You have seen the great stone in the city center? This is the gate to Shivalba. 
How can I stop the madness that seeps from below? What waits for me down there? You will find out when it is time. Her marked man descended, and the Katiganar slept. Follow his path. Do as he did. And did he return? No. You say there were others before me. Who were they? Marked men and women and things that went before. This place is old, but it still stands. Why do you call me Marked? You bear the touch of old Kay. You see more, feel more, and are even more inside. How do I open the gate in the monolith? You must search for a hollow. Craving to accept the seal. And that's it? No. The seal is incomplete. You must gather three gay fingers growing on the three monoliths and unite them with the seal. So I've got to find pieces of three monoliths. Can you at least tell me where they are? She doesn't know. But every cycle, the fire servants gather near these special places. Find them. They will have the answer. I just need to find the fire worshippers, then gather the three K fingers to complete the seal. I suppose it could be worse. She wishes you the wisdom to choose what must be chosen. But leave now. She must. Farewell. I don't know if it's possible, but I hope you can find some good in your new life. Oh, she will enjoy it. But must change before leaving this place. What do you mean by changing? Hmm? Okay, all evidence collected, but. No, I wanted to hear what he has to say about those strange things. Wait, what? Oh, there's some stuff down here. Nice. I think there's something out here as well, yeah? Yeah, it's very sunny outside and I cannot really tell what's happening on the screen at the moment. Okay, well, first of all, I want to upgrade my skill. We have two skill points, that's very nice. And go for that one. And I may go for the. Ready for the rifle. It only increases accuracy. Uh huh. Okay, so we have two of those. The oh, I think the third one was the. Yeah. Okay, I wonder why they couldn't tell him that. I am the city. Yes, you are. So hopefully I will get surface near the... No, I won't surface near the grave digger because usually something bad happens when I do. I wonder why. I think he resurfaces too quickly and loses con consciousness. I'm pretty sure that's it. Oh! Oh, this time you actually stayed awake. Nice, because I need you to speak to the guy. Oh, tough times have come, I say. Really? I thought I can talk to you about that. Well, guess not. So let's go to the library. Um, come on, thank you. Sabed, I know you're trying to kill me. I know I seem like a nice treat to all you man eating eels. But hell no, I have to go to the library. I hope. And then I have to visit the city hall. 
I know there's one monolith in Salvation Arbor. We were pretty near it. So you remember I I talked about it the last time, I think, or the time before that. But it was pretty uh, pretty recently. Mm, that's not the case I want. I want the, this one. Um, this one. Where is some properties to call section? Restricted section? European literature? 19th century. Secrets Beyond the Veil. F last reader. Fabian Cosby. Co official address Eastern Coverside Providence, Providence Avenue between St. Elmo and Victory Lane. Okay, that's what we wanted from here. Now let's go to City Hall. Of course, I'm too lazy to get there on foot, so we'll just use our phone booth. Get around, and we'll see what we can find out. It's pretty neat that if that it sh actually shows you when you're in the right archive. I didn't notice it. it I didn't know. Wow! I didn't notice it earlier, and I feel bad about that. Would have been very useful. Mm, Junior Copper, nineteenth century. Um, citizens? citizens of course. Virginia Cooper. Maple Lane between Polaris Road and Old Church Road in Northern Salvation Arbor. Okay, that's very useful. Let's see, As Eastern Cover Side. Where the hell is Cover Side? It's here. Providence Avenue, okay. Between Sound Elmo and Victory. So it's all, oh, it's gonna be underwater, I think. That's not that. Northern Salvation Arbor, and we have to go there, so that's nice. Maple Lane is here. Between Polaris Road and Old Church. That actually may be near where we are supposed to go. And let's see into the, into the depth. Hmm. Hmm. Wait, what? I fear that there may be no coming back from our homes next, so it's time to put all my affairs in order. Okay, so we'll do the rest in peace, and then uh, next time I think we're gonna end the game. But for now, that's it. Thank you very much, and bye bye!